it's your girl Christine and today we are checking out a snarled scary animation about Krampus. Um, you guys had a request that I check out another Krampus video. You guys are liking this Krampus thing that's going on? As far as the request, that first Krampus video didn't really do so well, but we'll see how the second one goes and then how this one goes. Link, this is by Snarled. You guys specifically asked for Snarled. Um, link for this video is in the description box below. This is You Better Watch Out, You Better Not Cry. Krampus story time. I'm glad I don't got a chimney. I, I, it's fine for me to watch this. I don't have a chimney, so it's okay. But y'all that got a chimney, be careful. You better not. You better watch out. And you better not cry. Link is in the description box below for you to check out. Now let's get started. I'm Sapphire. Want to hear something scary? Something scary. Twas the night before Krampus by Scott A. Johnson. Gather around, good boys and girls. Daniel Millar, Emma Sweeney, and yes, you too, Richard Blackwell. Are you all warm okay. and cozy? Good. Uh, yeah. Because now I'm it's afraid. time for a Christmas tale by mm. Scott A. Johnson. Twas the night before Christmas okay. and deep in our bunker, my mm -hmm. mom, dad, sister, and I did hunker. The street lights were dark, no carolers sang, All not right. even the blessings of old church bells rang. And beneath our beds, mm -hmm. we all huddled tight and okay. hoped he would pass by our house tonight. Oh, they knew he was coming. Everyone knows of Jolly St. Nick and mm -hmm. the gifts that he brings on his single night trick. And the presents and baubles and candy and toys mm -hmm. that he brings every Christmas to good girls and boys. But they not good it girls? wasn't the man with the red suit and white beard whose annual Christmas visit we feared. Outside in the snow, we heard a loud howl, the crunching of ice and an animal growl. I heard it sniff by our window pane, okay. then a deep throaty laugh and saw red eyes like flame. Oh, My sister and I both stared horrified and prayed that the creature could not get inside. Mm. But a moment later, a thundering pound <coughs> turned our door to splinters. Girl, girl, girl. Girl, you can't, be, you can't be doing that, okay? You can't be doing that. <laughs> the issue is, like, as you're telling, and I was wondering, in my mind, I'm like, oh, they haven't flipped to an animated slide yet. You're just looking at her face. So you're drawing into her eyes, and as she's telling the story, watching her eyes, and her eyes are just drawing me in. And then all of a sudden, boom, I was like, wait, I wasn't even ready for that. I wasn't ready. Because she's like drawing you in with her eyes. I think that's the main reason that they had it on her, focus on her eyes for so long, just so they can do that scare. Because you're just so, you're falling into it. You're like in the story. It's like she's, it's, she's mesmerizing you with her eyes. And then boom, <sighs> they got me. A moment later, a thundering pound turned uh, our door to again. splinters all over the ground. Dear. I screamed as the creature into our home came. Uh -uh. This horrible beast, Von Krampus uh -uh. by name. Uh -uh. He was what massively tall, at least seven feet, uh -uh. from the points of his horns to his hoof-shodden feet. Yikes. Across his back, what I mistook for a coat was the shaggy long hair of a filthy dead goat. Oh. And I cried and I swallowed a dead terrified pangs at the sight of his wickedly razor sharp fangs. Mm. His claw fingered hands looked ready for pain. Dear. In one was a bullwhip, the other a chain. Mm -hmm. He growled and he sneered and laughed for a while. Okay. Then he pointed at us and said, Naughty. With a smile. Mm. My sister and I both shook with fear. What terrible things had we done this year? Oh, they we tried to be good, to be good okay. and thought we succeeded. We minded our yeah, manners, no punishment needed. Oh. We both made good grades. We neither one lied or oh. cheated or stole. We had nothing to hide. But Krampus so still came with his evil heart black to steal us away, stuff us in his sack, oh. to take us away to his punishment cave oh. where all the bad children forever his slaves. Oh we turned gosh. to our parents behind them to hide, but they both shook their heads and sadly stepped aside. What? You must face the music, my father lamented. Von Krampus then laughed, his expression demented. Oh my, my sister gosh. and I hugged each other tight and prayed that someone could save us that night. And Wait, just when we gave hold up, on. The parents were like, sorry for you, and just stepped aside. Maybe he's talking to the parents. Maybe it was the parents he was saying was guilty. Let's see. Let's find out. I don't know. And all hope was gone 
there came a loud clatter from out on the lawn. With a tinkle of bells, our spirits did lift. Okay. Von Krampus snarled, the air he did sniff. Mm. On the wind came the scent of holly and pine, of gingerbread cookies and oh. holiday wine. That smells in good. the doorway he stood in his suit of bright red. St. Nicholas came, we cried oh, out good. and said, that's Save good. us, St. Nicholas, there's been a mistake. We've been good all year, you can't let him take. Hold on, not so fast, he raised his great hand. Okay. There is something happening you don't understand. What? Von Krampus did come, that much is true. But the demon of Christmas did not come for you. At the demon we stared, uh -huh. both of us confused. Uh -huh. He had to be here for somebody, but who? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Then I started to think and all became clear. Who'd been the naughtiest of all that year? Oh. The more that I thought, the more I oh. understood. Oh, wait. What the heck? Y'all saw them clips though, bruh? Who'd been the naughtiest of all that year? Huh, the mother? The more the that father? I thought, That's disgusting. the more I understood. The I stole the money? We children were fine. Wait, what did, did the father? Oh, okay, I don't want to keep going back to that clip. That's not the clip I'm trying to go to. Understood. We oh, children was he cheating? were fine, but the parents, no good. Mm. But Krampus takes children, my father protested, and Santa's face twisted toward the man he detested. That's the, yeah. Christmas time is for children and gifts to be given. Uh -huh. You took their innocence and that can't be forgiven. You Wait. scared them into silence, okay. their souls you did twist, oh my and gosh. to top it off told them I didn't exist. Oh. For your lifelong naughtiness, the piper must be paid. Dear. and set Krampus upon them with a dismissive wave. Oh, the adults screamed as they went into a sack, and we cried oh. until Santa patted my back. Okay. What's wrong? asked St. Nicholas. I thought you'd be happy mm -hmm. to be rid of those people who treated you crappy. Yeah. We are, I sniffed, sincere as could be. Okay. But what is to become of my sister and me? True. St. Nicholas smiled and laughed loud and deep. Mm -hmm. As did Krampus, a sound that still haunts my sleep. Oh, goodness. Why, you'll come with me, he said with great joy. Okay. I have great use for a good girl and boy. You'll come to my workshop and work with my elves. I promise that you will enjoy yourselves. Better? I'll teach you my secrets, my toy-making ways, and then you'll take over when I've ended my days. Oh, but, okay. said my sister, what about him? Won't Krampus be lonely? She scratched his chin. Mm -hmm. I wish to thank him, and I know the way. I will go with him and be his protege. Oh, wow. And so, okay. from Kris Kringle, I learned to make toys, and my sister to torture naughty girls and boys. Dear. And every evening from that point thereafter, my dreams were full of parent screams and my sister's laughter. Oh my and so goodness. this ends our happy Christmas story. If you're nice and not naughty, you've mm. no need to worry. But if your heart's full of coal like and you're an evil this. mister, try to hide, but you'll soon meet Krampus and my sister. I like that. If you liked this story, check out Creepy Little Bass. Okay, it's done. I liked that. I like that a lot. As far as the Krampus stories that we've, you know, watched or, or reacted to on this channel, this one's my favorite one. I like that, I love the poetic, um, flow that it has and on top of that I loved I love the poetic flow and um, I lost my train of thought because it reminded me of something I got to finish because uh, I haven't had a chance to and I need to work on it um but back on track I really liked it I, I was hoping when they said that the parents stepped aside I was like nah bruh please tell me that they're here for the parents because when the parents are like oh when he, he came and the kids ha hid behind the parents and the parents were like stepped aside and shook him like i'm sorry for you i was like okay clearly the parents cannot be good like they can't be good and i was hoping that they, that krampus was here for <sighs> the parents and he was. And then on top of that, I liked how the sister was so grateful that she's like, you know what, I don't want him to be lonely. I'm grateful for what you guys have done for us. You guys are helping us out in this situation. So I will go with Krampus and you go with um, St. Nick. I really liked it. I really liked it. They found um, something that'll make them happy. And um, 
you know, take the place of their parents who were very, like, very, uh, the, I can't believe, okay, so the mom, she stole, she, she, her drinking isn't a bad thing. I'm not gonna say that's a bad thing. Obviously, they might be talking about maybe being an alcoholic, but drinking on a, adults drinking is not bad. Being an alcoholic is bad, but an, an adult drinking is not bad. However, when she started taking money out of the piggy bank, that means that she was stealing from her children. That That's messed up. For you to give your child money in a piggy bank and then steal it, you know, and try to sneak steal it, because you see the girl peeking from behind the door, so she saw it. And then the father, um, him doing what he was doing, it's not a bad thing. He's an adult, let him do his thing. The bad thing is, home should have closed the door. Ninja, why you got your door open? Anybody could just roll up in there. Your daughter, he, she didn't even have to open the door. The door was wide open. So he needed to fix himself with that, um, which is the closing the door. But him leaving with the other chick, he was cheating on his wife. So that, I, I, I yeah, check mark, take him, and check mark, take the mother because she stole from her children. Those are the things that I thought were bad. There were like four things in the images, but I only thought two of them were actually bad. But anyways, let me know your thoughts. What did you think of the animation? What did you think of the story? Did you like the twist? If you liked that video, check out the link in the description box below to support Snarled. If you like this video, hug the life out of that like button. I love you guys as always. And until next time, buddies. Toodles.